Two beds. That one was my brother's. You have a brother? I didn't know. No, we're not close. My grandfather, who I knew very well, James Trenchard, he had a son, Oliver Trenchard, who had a son, me, Frederick Trenchard. My brother is James Trenchard. James and Frederick have been estranged. Our father was, for James, quite loving, and for Frederick, tyrannical. And so our childhoods were very different, and it's made us very different people. Because of Frederick's past and his upbringing, it's quite a frightening prospect for him to let someone else into his life. James has a lot of the qualities that Frederick finds so challenging. To be loving and open and vulnerable, it's not Frederick's strong suit. I thought I made myself clear last time we spoke. No further contact. But things change. Emily and Clara know each other better than anyone in the world, like sisters often do. There's so much love there. They do really, really love each other. Clara has this effervescent quality that people are drawn to. Emily is smart but she's not pretty. Because she's the older sister, Emily, I think that causes a bit of tension as well, because she should have married first, really. Clara is not just marrying anyone. She's marrying a lord, and she's becoming a lady. Where does that leave me as her big sister? Perhaps we can all meet together one day. The brothers and the sisters, the four of us. This is a real psychological exploration of these people behind closed doors and what happens when they're alone.